I'm Sumana Sanya. I am an associate professor at the Dunn School of Pathology here at the University of Oxford and also a tutorial fellow at Oriel College. Our research focuses on pathogenesis of emerging viruses and we have a particular focus on two different families of these viruses. One is flavivirus which includes dengue and Zika and more recently on the coronaviruses which includes SARS-CoV-2 which is the agent for causing the ongoing pandemic. So dengue, Zika and SARS, they are all important human pathogens. And here's a few numbers to illustrate the global burden caused by these viruses. Dengue is estimated to infect about 400 million people annually, of which 100 million develop symptoms. Zika infected about 2 million people during the outbreak in 2016. And SARS-CoV-2, of course, has infected more than 12 million and the pandemic is still going ongoing. So some of the clinical symptoms of these viruses are quite nasty and life-threatening. Flavi viruses can cause a host of different clinical manifestations, including neurotropic complications. Severe diseases can lead to hepatitis, uh, hemorrhagic fever and shock syndrome uh, in infected individuals. And coronaviruses, as we know, uh, causes, they cause respiratory distress. Um, and in acute cases causing pneumonia and ultimately death. So the main goal of our research is to understand the biology of these viruses and this is an example of what a dengue virus particle looks like. So these are small particles uh, which are about 550 to 100 nanometers in diameter. They carry a RNA molecule which is translated into 10 different proteins. And these can't replicate outside of the human host, so they need to infect a host cell in order to make multiple copies of themselves. So our main goals are twofold. One is to understand how they replicate once they infect an individual and how they spread within this in infected individual. And the second is to understand how they interfere with the host immune system, because as we know, most of the time, the severity of the disease arises out of aberrant immune responses. So all these viruses have several salient features. They have complicated life cycles, which starts with attachment of the virus to the host cell, as shown over here. They bind to surface receptors, which are proteins expressed by the host. They are then internalized into the host cell. And once they're inside, they undergo replication to make multiple copies of the viral genome also make viral proteins, and then they're assembled into viral progenies, which are then transported to the exterior of the cell so that they can infect neighboring cells and the rest of the, the organs in the human being. So our main goal is to understand what, what these individual steps are in order to be able to develop inhibitors against them, which can be developed into antiviral therapeutics to attenuate infection. And our current work is being supported by the Medical Research Council of UKRI and also the Wellcome Trust. Thank you.